Hello, it's your friendly neighborhood host, uh, J.T. Wheatley, back for another episode of the History of Comics podcast as uh, we uh, take a break between seasons for another uh, run of the classics, this time with one of my all-time favorites, Bone, by Jeff Smith. Bone is a fantasy series that ran from 1991 to 2004. For independently published and created by Jess Smith, in which uh, basically the uh, f- phone, uh, the Bone Brothers, uh, phone, bro- phone Bone, Phony Bone, and Smiley Bone, find themselves uh, dr- uh, after being run out of their hometown into a valley that's filled with rat creatures, dragons, and a mysterious uh, prophecy that they may or may not be involved in. It, it, soon enough, ha- hilarity and high fantasy ensue in what can best be described as what if the Looney Tunes walked into Lord of the Rings? That's literally what this is, as the, phone, as the Bone Brothers are essentially uh, practically cartoon characters in the comic book, whereas both the rest of the Valley characters are full-on uh, fantasy involving princesses and so forth. There's a lot of great hilarity and humor I mean, probably the, one of the best stories in this 55-issue uh, arc is The Great Cow Race, which is drop-dead hilarious, especially when Phony Bone, who's like the conman of the brothers, is always trying to scheme a way to win, uh, make money, and of course, it, blow, but it always seems to blow up in his face, and that story is drop-dead hilarious, but also great moments of uh, drama. Not every character in, makes it to the end of this uh, series, and it's, yeah, it's just a great fantasy series in general. It's one of my all-time favorites, and you can actually get the... Um, the entire series for a pretty good value at, at trade for like 30 bucks on Amazon in most uh, sellers. And it's in, and of course, it's in black and white. Also, the colorized edition. But I prefer the original black and white because that was meant to be done. But, but Jeff Smith did uh, oversee the colorization. So if you want to check out your one, they're great. But this is in my top five of my all-time favorite comic book stories. So, yes, this, this week on the edition of the classics, check out Bone by Jeff Smith, a true classic. Now it is January 7th, 2020. Time for my favorite comic of the week. Monstrous Talk Stories, number one, by Marjorie Liu and Sana Takeda, which uh, is a neat little short uh, fantasy story that takes place in a refugee's camp where we hear uh, a story from a young fox child named Kippa about her past uh, trying to help her younger sister and her family during hard times. Even though this, um, this is actually the first time I've ever read Monsters, which by all accounts is one of the uh, best fantasy series that come out in recent years in comics. It was a recent Eisner Award winner back in 2018. But uh, I, this is a nice, a nice jumping off point that it gets into this small personal story that's really tragic and heartwarming about uh, Kippa just trying to be a good sister to her and also a good uh, daughter to her parents. But uh, they can't, unfortunately, that's too young to understand that some things you just can't fix, and they can sometimes even make things worse. Uh, Lou does a wonderful job with the characters, makes it easy, easily accessible, and also the Kate's art is gorgeous with a great fantasy feel, and honestly reminds me of the great Final Fantasy concept and the uh, b- box art that comes with those classic video games. That's what it honestly reminds me of. It has that real fantasy, just look and feel to it. So if you've read Monstrous, and no doubt you'll be checking out this issue, if you haven't read Monstrous, uh, check this out. Uh, really good comic book. And uh, with that, like I said, uh, I'm uh, in between the seasons uh, three and, heading, and trying, working on four right now. And uh, yeah, but uh, hopefully we'll get that up and running in pretty soon. I like to have my bank uh, filled in and ready to go. But till then, I'll be throwing out a few more classic episodes, a little quick listens to uh, give you some reading recommendations and so forth. And like I said, until then, uh, go out and enjoy yourself a good comic book. And among those, definitely check out Bone by Jeff Smith because that is a true classic. <laughs>